Well, hello and welcome back to my channel. We are doing another thrifting my Pinterest board. This time around, we are thrifting the quiet luxury trend. It's the old money aesthetic, even a little bit of like the Euro girl vibe. Classic, it's timeless and effortless. I feel like Sophia Richie has been the face of the quiet luxury trend. So that's what we're gonna thrift today. I have the Pinterest board for inspiration. You can find my Pinterest if you want. If you like thrifting and thrifting videos, be sure to give this one a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe because it really supports the channel and follow me over on instagram for some more styling thrifting and beauty as well so let's head on in and look for our quiet luxury old money aesthetic we are at savers thrift store today i do have a 30 percent off coupon so let's thrift some pieces So starting off in the dress section, it's very busy today. So I have my little rolly cart. So definitely anything with stripes. I found these two that are awesome. This one's a size small, it's by Express, so I don't think it would fit, but very Sophia Richie. And then this one's a little too big, um, but I think both of them would be great. More as swim cover-ups this one you could even wear open with like some white shorts or something love it Structured kind of works for this trend. Definitely see this paired with some sandals and like a crocheted or some sort of straw bag would be really cute. Maybe we try it on. Definitely neutral shades and colors. Um, I feel like the print is really just like a stripe, very minimal on any type of print or pattern. This also could be very cute. If it's my size. Oh, it's XRX large, no. But very pretty. Again, with sandals and just a straw bag, maybe a hat. All right, so these are some of the things that I have found so far. This was in the dresses. I feel like it could also work as like an oversized, very lightweight coat. Loving the buttons. And I love like the cuffed sleeve with the different liner color. It's just very lightweight. You guys found this one with me. I feel like you could also tie a belt with this, like a little braided belt. But definitely some sandals, brown sandals, and like a straw or crocheted bag. And very classic sunglasses. I feel like Sophia Richie definitely would have worn something like this on her wedding weekend. Those were kind of like the explosion of her new style, quiet luxury. Loving the deep V and loving these buttons. Also this linen material is everything. And like the back is so cute as well. Fortunately it's a small, so I don't think it would fit me. This dress to me also screams like old money. 
with the chain detail. It's all about structure, structured pieces. Um, I feel like gold would be more of the trend, would be more on trend for this, but this is definitely a part of the picture. It's too big for me, so I'll be leaving this one behind. Finally, I feel like this one is just kind of like a touch on the trend. Stripes, the buttons, light colored and the linen material. Again, with some sandals and just a straw bag. Very cute. Okay, so that's all I found in the dresses. Kind of struck out, nothing was really my size or my style. Like if I'm gonna do these videos, I still want it to be something that I will wear in my everyday wardrobe, so oh well. Now we're in the pants section. It's definitely all about the tailored pant, maybe a pleat, a dress pant, a structured pant. Um, so maybe like a trouser, a linen pant. Let's see what we can find. Her leg. Oh, I definitely love sort of like the flare on this one. Definitely worth trying on. Pleat front, check. I feel like a crop leg even works for this trend and a nice, really pretty coloring. I'm not sure the brand. These are not quite my size, but these are perfect. They're a really nice lightweight linen pant. Definitely giving that old money feel if you wear like white on white. Um, so definitely look out for any type of linen pant. All right, we're hiding out in the children's section for this try-on portion. First up, we're gonna do these lightweight pants. I have no idea how much of me you'll actually be able to see. This is really fun, not having a cart. Not really sure if these are even gonna fit, but we shall see. I remembered to wear the correct shorts this time to try things on. You know what I should do? Let's go find a mirror. Okay, located a mirror, but I feel like they put the mirrors in like the busiest part of the store. All right, definitely getting old money feels from these. I even feel like the crop leg kind of works as well. Oh, I think I like these. Okay, these are those like wider legged trousers, kind of a flare. They are a lower. It's hard to see because I'm wearing like all black, but they are a lower cut, which I actually don't mind these days. But these are also a yes. It's hard to tell, but these are a yes. Okay. These are a no. Hate the fit. These were the express ones. I hate them. 
Okay, these are the first pair of the Banana Republic trousers that I picked up. They honestly fit identical to the other ones. Again, they're low rise, so I think I'll just stick with the other ones. All right, so I did pretty good in the pants section. I think I'm gonna head over to the men's. I feel like the key terms for this look is structured and tailored. So I would love to find like a men's vest that would match each of those like trouser pants. I just feel like that's such like a luxe look. So we're gonna look for those. And then we're also gonna look for more of these oversized button up shirts. Definitely a part of the trend. We wear them with trousers or pair them with shorts. And I feel like if you look in the men's section, that's where you, that's actually where I found this one. But that's where you find a lot of those striped white linen material. So let's head over there. This one is perfect. It's like a really lightweight, oversized, and I feel like it's perfect thrown over with some linen shorts. It's only $5.99, definitely add to cart. Definitely love any of them with the stripes. This is pretty much identical to the one that I have on, so I'll leave this one behind. Um, but I'm loving the one next to it with this like thicker stripe. LL Bean. Definitely adding to cart. Love the pastel shades of this, like the lavender, green, and blue. It's this linen material as well. Even the buttons. This one is awesome too. I feel like I've definitely seen like this exact style somewhere, um, but I do already have two in my cart and this one is like $12, so I'll leave it behind. I feel like for tanks, I'm just looking for very minimal, simple tank tops. The turtleneck tank totally works as well, but it just doesn't scream like a summer vibe to me, so we'll leave this one behind. These racks are also so tight together, like I don't know how well you can see any of the clothes. I'll try my best. type of layered look always screams old money and preppy to me so this little sweater layered over one of our button-ups definitely on trend I know that this is like a sports top but the piping on the sides reminds me of some of the pieces that I've seen so it's Nike $11 Despite it being extremely crowded in there, I don't know what was going on today that everyone decided to go thrifting. Um, but despite the crowds, that was a very, very successful thrifting adventure. 
journey that we went on together. Quiet luxury, old money aesthetic wardrobe for under a hundred dollars. We have pants, we have tops. I don't even remember what else we have. Um, so we're gonna head home and I will put some outfits together and show you this quiet luxury, old money, minimalist, Euro girl aesthetic thrift haul. Okay. Time for the thrift haul. I am just gonna kind of put some outfits together and I'll tell you what's what. Look number one is by far my favorite combo and definitely hits the quiet luxury mark on the nose. I definitely saw this version. I think it was like all cream. I knew that I was not gonna walk out of the thrift store <laughs> without some form of this vest and trouser combo. The pants are the Banana Republic. These were the ones that were new with tags and then the vest I found in the men's section. And I love this look. And then look number two, keeping the same pants I was wearing before, I threw on the light blue button up shirt. There was definitely a couple of ways on the Pinterest board that you could style one of these blue shirts. So I would definitely grab one of these. I just opted to leave it loose and oversized and then just throwing over this sweater that I thrifted today. I don't know if I showed it to you. And then keeping on those same J. Crew sandals. I love that this looks very intentional and polished, but it also feels very relaxed because everything is oversized and loose fitting, so you're comfortable. And this reminds me of like the Euro girl style for sure. It's effortless, it's classic, and it's timeless. It's definitely one of those go-to outfits when you want to look put together and stylized, but you're still seeking comfort. Everything is flowy and breathable, and I look like I stepped off a yacht, but I'm ready for anything. Okay, look number three, keeping the same sweater as before. This one is also, it's just another chic and timeless look. It's all about structured, tailored. Those are the key words for this look. I love the pleat fronts. They're nice and tailored. Um, I even love that they're kind of like a cropped look to show off our sandals. Um, a basic white tee. This is just from my closet. And we have the sweater that we thrifted, the pants we thrifted. Finished it off with my ASO slides and some sunnies with some gold touches. She screams old money. She's quiet and she's luxurious. They're just simple, minimalist, easy to wear. I also picked up these two linen shirts. I just loved the striped detail, the lightweight material. You could throw it over your structured pant and tuck them in. I like how they just wear them sort of just like open and free. I mean, this shirt paired with like a black maxi um, or something like this, it's just free and open. Did the yellow striped as well. I think these also work so cute as swim cover-ups or pairing them with some linen shorts. I definitely wouldn't wear this yellow shirt with these pants, but I just wanted to try it on for you. All right, look number four. Taking some serious inspiration from the Pinterest board, we have the flowy linen pants. These I did not thrift today. I um, actually got these from Princess Polly, but we thrifted the sporty Nike top and the oversized button-up shirt. She's sporty, maybe she plays tennis, fresh off the tennis court. It's that fresh off a yacht sort of look. Okay guys, so that was the thrift trip and the thrift haul. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today and I hope you enjoyed this quiet, luxury, old money aesthetic video. Let me know if there's any other aesthetics or styles that you want me to thrift down below in the comment section um, or just comment to say hi. I love chatting with you guys. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next one.